As we graduate today, we leave behind a standard for future classes. However, we take with us our accomplishments and memories. As each member of our class accepts their diploma, they have seen another rung on the ladder of life, another accomplishment. We have been prepared to deal with the adversity we may encounter in the future. Our character will, di will dictate our success and happiness. Emerson writes, character is higher than intellect. We have had the intellectual preparation here to learn and adapt. As we venture into life, our values will be the driving force behind our successes. Our integrity with respect to the ethics of society will contribute to or hinder our progress. Values must be higher than any one individual, higher than the society itself. At all times, we must maintain our integrity. I am one man and can make a small difference in life, yet we are a graduating class of 495, we can make a great difference in the world. I again thank the class for allowing me to lead them and thank Mr. Brogan for his support. Thank those dedicated, caring teachers for their teaching and wish all of you the best of luck in future endeavors. Thank you. me I might withdraw his English grade and therefore draw, withdraw his diploma. He quickly reminded me that I didn't have him as an English student, so that wasn't possible. As advisor of the senior class, uh, I want to thank all of you, the administration, the faculty, the staff, the parents, the guests, even the guests here, for being very patient with us um, and understanding us during this past year. It's very difficult to sponsor the senior class and put on all the things that Kevin has mentioned. It has been a unique blessing for me to guide and mold and advise these students. They've been very helpful and cooperative. I couldn't have asked for better. I'm looking forward to a continued friendship with some, if not all of them, in one way or the other. I'd like to leave you now with a few lines from Hamlet, not the entire first act, only about five lines that some of you may recognize. I think they're quite appropriate. And they say, This above all, to thine own self be true, and it must follow as the night the day that thou canst not then be false to any man. Farewell, my blessings in this. The time invites you. Go. Thank you. and welcome. It's with great purple and white pride I congratulate the 1991 graduating class. Academic excellence has been part of this class. However, there are some that have achieved at such a level that we want to acknowledge and recognize this achievement. The California Scholarship Federation congratulates and welcomes as lifetime members those who have challenged themselves in a very rigorous college prep uh, course offering and in that maintaining an A average. Please stand and step forward as I introduce you as well as your college direction. Tom Cho, our CSF president, UCLA. Tom. Christy Kramer, Mount St. Mary's. Christy, stand and step forward. Joe Wynn, Stanford. <laughs> Sung Hoon Kang, University of Illinois. Going there. Susan Pei, Berkeley.
Caroline Shu, UCLA. Tony Lee Berkeley. Chin Ping Berkeley. Tree Long Trang, Loyola, Marymount. Ravinda Sedebecha, uh, uh, UC. William Roy Oya, Occidental. Charlie Yoon, Dartmouth. Kenny Way, UCLA. That group has honored themselves by maintaining the A average in their, cor their courses for six semesters at Hoover High School. Five semester honorees go to David Chin, UCLA. Marion Ajanian, UCLA. Robert Lee, West Point Academy. <laughs> Tyler Kabota, Occidental. <laughs> Helen Chin, UCLA. <laughs> Daniel Nam, UCLA. <laughs> Four semesters go to the following. Wendy Gavidia, UCLA. <laughs> Vilma Mejida, UC Davis. <laughs> David Bronner, Harvard. <laughs> Renee Gabri, Arizona. <laughs> Louis Valara, UCLA. Kevin Nelson, UC San Diego. <laughs> Tin Tron, Cal State Northridge. <laughs> and Jonathan Kim, Berkeley. Some interesting statistics on the graduating class of 1991 include the fact that 90 of this graduating class will be attending either a UC, a Cal State, or a four-year college in the state of California. An additional 25 will be attending a four-year college university outside of the state of California, and 275 will be attending Glendale College. <laughs> Hoover holding the honor of having the greatest number of students enrolled in their honors course of any of the surrounding <laughs> high schools in the area. So congratulations to all graduates. Thank you. We are gathered here today to congratulate the class of 1991 perhaps the greatest class ever to walk the halls of Hoover. The young adults sitting on this field deserve to feel proud of the accomplishments they have made, the knowledge they have gained, and the obstacles they have overcome. Today, as I look around, I see no losers, only winners. I see the class of 1991. This is a class filled with drive, determination, and diversity. Yes, diversity. We are a class of many colors, races, and beliefs. Yet we are a class of friends, which is a theme of the poem, Human Family. I note the obvious differences in the human family. Some of us are serious, some thrive on comedy. I've sailed upon the seven seas and stopped in every land. I've seen the wonders of the world. Not yet one common man. We love and lose in China, we weep on English moors, and laugh and moan in Guinea, and thrive on Spanish shores. We seek success in Finland, are born and die in Maine. In major ways we differ, 
excuse me, in minor ways we differ, in major, we're the same. I note the obvious differences between each sort and type, but we are more alike, my friends, than we are unalike. We are more alike, my friends, than we are unalike. Judge a person not by their character, and not, judge a person by their character, not their color. As for my family, I would now like to introduce my foster parents and my natural mother. If they will please stand. Remain standing. Not off the hook yet. Keep standing. Without these special people, I would not be where I am today. I owe a great deal to you. To my mom, I told you that all those hours spent on the phone, I really was doing my homework. <laughs> and yes, Dad, I really do study better with the television on. To my natural mother, I am glad to have you here. Doi frat anan dui kama kwea kuivi ane. Often I've heard people ask if you are proud of me, but I want you to know it is I who am proud of you. I thank you. I'd like to ask the proud parents of each graduating senior to please stand. Up. <laughs> please stand. You are here today to congratulate your sons and daughters. Yeah, on behalf of the class of 1991, the students will please join me. I would like to congratulate all of you. Thank you. Because of your guidance, compassion, and love, you can be assured that we leave home prepared for the challenges ahead of us. Your sons and daughters are reflections upon all of you. I hope you are proud of what you have accomplished. As for the members of the graduating class, I challenge each and every one of you to reach for your dreams. Everything you can want is out there for you. With unlimited possibilities available, the future is yours. Yours to find and yours to make. Never, for, never settle for less than you deserve. Take chances, be aggressive. There will be times when you will stumble. There will be times when you will fall. But never forget who you are. Stand tall, stand proud. Go forward, never looking back. Believe in yourself and your abilities. For those individuals sitting on the bleachers and standing on the street behind, believe in you. However, the support given extends beyond friends and family. I would now like to share a letter with you. To the class of 1991, Hoover High School. Dear seniors, it is my pleasure to extend to you my, more, my warmest congratulations on the occasion of your graduation from Hoover High School. The happiness and sense of satisfaction that you feel are well deserved. Graduation day is a time to be proud of all you have accomplished and to look forward to the opportunities that lie ahead of you. As time goes by, the importance of the lessons you have learned, the education you have received, and the friendships you have formed will become even more apparent. In the days and years to come, many challenges and opportunities will cross your path. In preparing yourself to meet these challenges, I hope that you will do the best job you can. You can Use all of the natural talents God gave you and never give up. If you perform accordingly, you will certainly be successful in life. Mrs. Quayle and I are honored to join you, your family and your friends, in sending our blessings to you on this very special day. We hope that the years ahead prove equally rewarding and enjoyable. Congratulations and best wishes. Sincerely, Dan Quill, Vice President of the United States. <laughs> Seniors will receive a copy of this letter with their diploma as a reminder that if others believe in you, you should believe in yourself. I would like to thank the senior class, my friends, the faculty, and the administration for making this one of the best years ever. I end my speech with a warning. Look out, world. Here comes a class in 1991. Thank you. I'd like to introduce to you Dr. Don Lempe, the district representative, the deputy superintendent of instruction. Members of are we ready? 
Joe Wynn. <laughs> Helen Chen. Daniel Nam. Scott Bay. Wendy Gavidia. David Bronner. Renee Gabri. Louis Malara. Tin Tron. And Jonathan Kim. Kaine Avanes. Mirna Marcel. Frederick Amirian. Hogos Paul Arhelian. Paris Arbatsadeh. Young Mi Florence Beck. Arbat Aragonian. Rene Arredondo. Kathleen Anderson. Yeah. Joseph Pei. Jama Yasuk Lil. Yu Ki Min. Pao Pambukian. Stephanie M. Leslie. Adele Beth Ann Porter. Hyung Jun Park. Brett Rubio. <laughs> Kelly S. Fjord. Karen Pruitt. Oh. Kathia Santis Devon. <laughs> Andrew Schroeder. Odette Rodriguez. <laughs> Molly Catherine Cecilia Saparito. <laughs> Jimmy Schmidt. <laughs> Wayne Wong. Greta Sukasian. <laughs> Yvette Takmazian. <laughs> Peyton Williams. <laughs> Rafi Yakobian. <laughs> Victoria <laughs> Tarula. Second picture. Yeah. Lynn Ann Stewart. Rita Chavdarian. Paul J. Whaley. Eileen Joanna Stansel. Andrea Terrell, Robert Wally, He Yu, Carol Suda, Thelma Tamazian, Richard Valoria. Joseph Yoon.
immediately following the ceremony, you're they come down on the field and also a reception by the Purple Circle PTA by the cafeteria. If the graduates will move their tassels from the left to the right hand side. Ladies and gentlemen, the graduates of Hoover High School. Thank you for your attendance. Feel free to come down onto the field. Thank you.